Hi everyone, Elizabeth here. Thank you for joining me today and thank you for joining me on my unboxing journey. Today I'm going to be unboxing um, something a little bit different. I'm going to be unboxing the three Ipsy variations. So first up we have the Ipsy small bag. This was $10 and it just went up to $12 a month and you get five sample products. Sometimes you get some full size products there. The next one is the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. This one is $25 a month and you get five full size products. I've only been doing this one a few time, uh, a few months and I do really, really like it. And the last one is the Ipsy Glam Bag Ultimate. And this one is new for October and this one is $50. I'm definitely not gonna keep this one, but I did wanna show you the three different variations so you can compare them and decide which one you think is best for you. Okay, so we're gonna get started with the $12 version of Ipsy Glam Bag, and it comes in a little bag like this. And I like to pull all the products out and display them. And on the back, we've got some sequins, really pretty, and Betty Boop's picture. And it comes with a little card that has the information about each product. So the first thing we have is this Benefit Cosmetics, their Real Lengthening Mascara in Jet Black. And this is a really good mascara. I highly recommend it. I did get it in another bag recently and I absolutely love this. The next thing is this Bo Gashi's Concealer Brush. And this is a really nice brush. I have like a super old one from MAC from years ago. So I can definitely update my brushes with this one and it has the, the name there. The next item is this Mark Anthony, let's see, Strengthening Grow Long Super Fast Strength Leave-In Conditioner. That sounds really good. I do love leave-in conditioners. My hair is super thick, so I'm excited to try this. I've never tried this brand, so that's always fun. The next thing is this Betty Boop lipstick. So Ipsy collaborated with Betty Boop's brand, and that's why we have the Betty Boop. So this is the lipstick the color there and this one is called mob it baby cute name oh and it is a very nice mob i love this color of lipstick this is one of my favorites so i'm excited about that one and this is of course a full size full size and the next thing we have is oh it's under here this kanuka let's see kanuka hydrating Kanuka CBD Hydrating Lip Balm. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, it smells like limey. Let's read a little bit about it. Kanuka's products use CBD derived from hemp. It's non-psychoactive, safe for all ages, and has strong anti-inflammatory properties to heal your skin. The lightweight nourishing lip balm is made with CBD and Manuka honey to calm inflammation and soothe dry, chapped lips. Now that is really nice. So this is a full size as well. So this is what we've got for $12. I think, what do you think? I think this is a really good deal for $12. Uh, full size lipstick, lip balm, brush, a little sample sizes, and then this mascara is awesome. So I'm really happy with this bag. Moving on to the next one. Okay, so in our Ipsy Glam bag, looks like this. Glam Bag Plus, we have a different Betty Boop bag. So this one just has her silhouette and has a sequence on the, on the back. And it, it looks like it is slightly bigger than the Glam Bag one. So there's that. So nice little bag. I like to have the matching set of bags. That's pretty cool. So the first thing we have out of this $25 version of the Ipsy subscription is this Dr. Brandt and I love everything Dr. Brent. <laughs> I, I get so excited when I get Dr. Brent stuff in my subscription boxes because this stuff is expensive. The value for this is $79, you guys. That's crazy. Um, so this is a microdermabrasion age-defying exfoliator. It's like a trip to the derm in a jar. What more could you want, right? Gently massage a dime-sized amount onto skin for one to two minutes, avoiding sensitive areas. I try to exfoliate at least once a week. Um, it's always, you don't want to over exfoliate. So this is always nice. I like that. I'm very excited to try that out. 
The next thing we have is this. Let me pull it out. Real Her. I haven't heard of this brand. This is called I Am Adaptable Matte Lipstick, Liquid Lipstick. And the value of this is $20. So let's try it out. This is like super duper red. Whoa. Look at that, you guys. That is so pretty. I love red and it matches like the Betty Boop theme. Cute. Okay, next we have this little jar by Tarte, I mean little box. And it looks like it says Tarte Chrome Paint, oops, pardon. Chrome Paint Shadow Pot and Steel, the show. The value of this is $22. Oh wow. Oh, I broke the seal. What is this? Is it like a loose powder? I have no idea. I okay, I'm gonna swatch it. What the heck, I like Tarte Tarte. Okay, it is not a loose powder. Oh my gosh, it is so gorgeous. Look at that color. Oh, I love it. I love, I love Tarte. Tarte's one of my favorite uh, makeup brands. Okay, it says a cool toned steel shade with a mirror-like shine and a rich creamy feel. Your lids have been waiting for a shadow this good. This loose pigment is made with 80% pure pearl minerals and instantly melts onto your skin with serious lasting powder. Plus, it's 100% vegan and cruelty free. How is this loose powder? I have no idea, guys. Well, I'm excited to try it either way. So. Okay, up next is this Trist, what is the brand called? Tristique All Over Starlight Powder Stick in Ultra Violet. So the value for this one is $18. Okay, I've never seen anything like this. This is interesting. So it's like, oh, that's pretty. Okay, guys, I am not going to swatch this because I will not be using this. It's not my thing. So this is a highlighter. It says for a subtle glow, sweep a brush over the stick. Oh, sweep a brush over the stick and apply to high points of the face. See, I would have just like brushed it on my face. I'm not good with highlight. I need to work on that. Next, the last product we have in here is this Betty Boop. Um, this is the Cheek to Cheek Blush Palette. And oh, this is pretty. Look at the packaging. Very nice. And the value of this one is $28. These are really pretty colors, you guys. I love all of those colors. I can wear all of those. I would blend them all. Yep. These are really pretty. This is my favorite right here. I love this color. Does it have names? Mm, oh, yeah. It says, you're a peach, all dolled up, and heartbreaker. These are cute little names. Okay, I like that. Okay guys, so we just unboxed the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, and this is what we got, these five products. We have the Microdermabrasion, Lip Gloss, Tarte, Eyeshadow, Betty Boop um, Blush, and this, all for $25. I think this was an excellent value, especially because of this. I can't wait to use this tonight. Okay, so up next is our ultimate box. So, the ultimate box is like jam-packed with stuff. Okay, and then we have this like super long accordion uh, list of things. So this is gonna be a long one, guys. All right, so first up, we have the same bag that we got in our Glam Bag Plus, but don't worry, Ipsy knows, and they are going to not make the same mistake next month for the November box. And then next, another Betty Boop cheek palette and again Betty uh, Ipsy did email me letting me know so they sent me 1200 Ipsy points for me to use uh, to redeem on ipsy.com to make up for that I wish I had gotten the eyeshadow palette that would have been perfect okay so the first thing we have is this Nanette Lepore beautiful times this is a fruity scent uplifting warmth scent 
Okay, this one says, the fashion guru's fragrances are inspired by her bohemian designs. Her bright, juicy fragrance features notes of mandarin, violet, violet, and caramelized sugar. Ooh, it sounds yummy. I'm going to try it because it's late at night and I am going to go to sleep, so I don't think I'll get a headache. Just trying this out. Mmm, it smells really good. I could smell, like, the fruity flavor in there. Okay, so the next thing is this huge Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Melt Away. This is a cleansing balm. I did get a trial in another box, but I've never used it, to be honest with you. It says, how to use gently massage onto dry skin for eye makeup removal applied to closed eyes. Rinse with warm water or wipe off with damp washcloth. Mm, it smells very good. It's very minty. It's so pretty. This is a huge box. This is full size. The, this was trial size. The next thing we have are these two sheet masks. And these are by The Same. That's the name of the brand. S-A-E-M. Right there. And one is shea butter and the other one is avocado mask. And these are like sheet masks. Next, we have this little sample of Papa Recipe Eggplant Clearing Mud Cream Mask. So another mask. Okay. Um, this one is a cream mask. I do prefer cream masks at, um, over sheet masks, so that's good. The sheet mask I'll probably give to my daughter. Next up, we have this Pure Lease Matcha Green Tea Antioxidant Priming Moisturizer. Ooh, this sounds fun. This is a really good brand. I do know that. I think I have, oh, no, I don't have anything by this brand, do I? Not that I've used, or not that I am using right now. So this is a lightweight oil-free moisturizer that preps the skin for makeup application. Green tea helps protect from fine lines and wrinkles. Yay! While white tea, vitamin E, and French marine plants help retain moisture so your skin looks dewy and radiant. Oh, yes. I'm excited to try this. I'm going to try this tomorrow morning. Next, we have this, and I don't know how to pronounce it, Cest Moi Beauty, French. Reflect lip gloss and opulence. Ooh, this is pretty. It's such a pretty package. It has like little gemstones. Do you see those? Is it focusing? Focus. There you go. And it is very, it looks like a clear glass, but it's iridescent. It has some iridescent in there. Okay, this is going to be nice to try. This looks like a full size, right? I think. Next up, we have, this is a, an eyeshadow palette that I chose. Um, during the options period and this is Huda Beauty Obsessions eyeshadow palette in Topaz Look how gorgeous all these colors are. I just want to wear them all. They're so beautiful. I love them I just want to look at them They're so pretty. Okay, so there's that this is a full size next up we have this colored rain cosmetics eyeshadow and glamour this is a really pretty color. It, oh, it's called Glamour. And it looks like metallic. Oh, this is really pretty, guys. Can you see that? There you go. That is a really pretty color. I can definitely wear this. I'm going to try that one tomorrow. Next, we have this Unicorn Glow. Do I have it right? Unicorn Glow hydrating primer and this looks like a little sample size okay next is this bio race zooming in Lou hydrating treatment serum i am a sucker for serums i love serums this looks like a full size and this is it says intensive hydrating serum by bio race locks in moisture and keeps your skin soft and supple ideal for all skin types Cool. Well, I'm excited to try that one. Next, we have three Farrah brushes, and these are really pretty br brushes. They have like a blue hue to them. We have one called Cheeky End, and this one is for blush. And then we have the Stippling one, and this one is for bronzer or highlight. And then this one, 
um, is called the Straight Brush. And this one, it says it's to buff foundation into your skin. So I don't really use brushes for foundation, but I think I'll start. And I love Farrah brushes because they have this, these like grooves for your fingers and it really helps holding the brush. Okay, and the last thing that we have in my box is this Tristique Mascara. And I did get this in a box before. It's called the Icelandic Black Liqueur. And I actually didn't keep the mascara because I, I didn't really like it. And I did give it to a friend. And this is pretty cool because it is... You flip this down and it crimps your lashes and then the mascara is on the bottom. I may give this another try. So this is a full size product. The odd thing is that the Tristique Mascara is not on here. So I'm not sure what that's all about. Is it a bonus item? I'm not really sure, you guys. Okay, so here's just about everything that we got for $50 in the Ultimate. And now I can't really tell you that I think it's worth $50. I am not going to renew it next month. I may just skip this month, so maybe they can work out their kinks. But um, I think for $50, I get more value in some other boxes than this particular box, but I do like the products. There's nothing in here I don't like, so I am happy about the products. I'm just not, I just don't feel like it's worth $50. Oh, can't forget this and this also for $50. Okay, that's it for now. Thank you so much for joining me. Let me know what you think of this comparison video. Let me know if you'd like to see some more comparison videos. It was kind of fun to do. So I'd really love your input. Please do leave a comment below, like this video, subscribe to my channel if you aren't already, and follow me on Instagram. I'm at, at PR Mompreneur. Thank you again for joining me. Bye.